everybody, this is Larry. This is day 26 of the Lico Day Challenge. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, join me in Discord. Let me know what you think about today's farm. I hope like you like the intro as usual, or the usual for the last week. I'm still in San Salvador. Though today, I'm taking it a little bit easy. I don't know if you can tell it in my voice. Uh, I My throat is killing me a little bit. I have a little bit of sore throat. Um, yeah, I don't know. But also let me know if that it has it is like a, a sexy uh a sore throat kind of voice or is it just like an annoying sore throat? I don't know. I'm always curious. But in any case, today we have 494 targets some. Uh you're given an indig oh yeah, one more thing that I always spam uh is that if you want to hear more or you want to see these drone videos and and just like the stories behind what I've been doing, uh follow me on Instagram, which is Larry somewhere, but also it's on the description below if you want to find it uh today we have 494 target sum all right uh duh, 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 duh. so yeah either plus or minus okay uh the first thing i was going to say is that this is of course a classic problem um and maybe you could do dynamic programming with it but that said uh mm, yeah i don't know i mean you still can to be honest, but the the reason why I'm like well, eh, it's a little bit odd is because there's only twenty numbers, so you don't even have to. Um, you can just do two to the twenty, right? Um, the reason is two to the twenty is that for every number, basically you're just adding the prefix and the suffix. Oh, sorry, just the prefix, right? To plus or minus, and of course there are two ways. So then, um, yeah. So then you just evaluate them, right? And that's pretty much it. So yeah, so maybe you can do something like, and this may be a little bit too slow because Lico sucks and Python is terrible on it uh, in terms of performance. Um, because usually I would say twenty times two to the twenty should be fast enough, but that it's gonna be uh, twenty million, right? Which is in on Lico too slow, fast enough probably for one input, but maybe too slow overall. But that said, I'm lazy, so I'm uh. So let's maybe try it, maybe not. Well, actually, we'll just do it the recursive way, but it still has a little bit of overhead, so we'll see. Right, so we, we want to go, um, I don't know. Eh. And what I mean by I don't know is that I, naming things is hard, so I'm always trying to find, uh, what is it called? I just go uh, evaluate, say. And you have an index, right? Um, yeah, and then a current number, current. And that's it. That's all you need, right? Uh, yeah. And then if index is equal to n, then you're done. Uh, if current is equal to zero, oh sorry, if current is equal to target, we return one way to do it. Otherwise, we return zero. And then the, this is just the uh, the traditional count your ways type of thing, but uh, but without even needing to memorize. Though you can actually just add memorization here, and it would be a way easier. Uh, uh addition that we find and it just kind of you know you love it you uh you evaluate index plus one current plus target or not plus target stumps up index and then minus right and that should be good enough for, for us to be happy and then we just evaluate uh zero zero right uh and of course you can actually write this in a little bit different way as well but uh let's give it well i was gonna say give it a quick submit but we can actually do uh the like the worst case is uh easy to do the worst case for my input not necessary for, or for my 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 uh, code not necessary for whatever uh, it looks okay right i mean it runs at least see it was actually kind of odd but uh, no no it isn't because the 20 numbers so plus one minus one you can't really get an odd number parity reasons Let's give a quick submit, see if it's fast, or Leetcode will give me crap for uh, yeah, for not memorizing. We could do a memorization, it's not that much of an issue. But that's the thing, right, is that, like I said, this is 2 to the 20. Is it fast enough? Apparently not, but it should be, if you ask me, right? It is what it is. So yeah, so another way that, I mean, a quick way to do it is just add cash, honestly. Um, right? And yeah, and the reason why, and I didn't want to do it because I, I feel like it seems an unnecessary optimization, but it only is necessary because of lead code. 
because there's no reason why this should be 20 if you know eh. like maybe if you set it to 50 then you know then we definitely need to um and the reason why is because current given these constraints the sum of all the numbers are up to a thousand right so that means that current will be at most a thousand um or negative a thousand maybe uh yeah something like that uh and then index well there's only 20 so 20 times a thousand is gonna be really fast and i knew that but i i i just eh. it just feels like it's one of those things like i, I think one thing that I, I am i do try to do sometimes is uh and it's just you know focus on solving the problem and don't worry about all these like tricks and stuff uh and yeah uh, uh that is all I have for today. Let me know what you think. I'm still a little sick or whatever under the weather. So yeah, I'm going to call it a night. Thanks for watching. Stay good. Stay healthy. To your mental health. I'll see y'all later. Take care. Bye-bye.